Hey guys, Chris at U-Joint. Wrapping up this uh, De Javier conversion. So this is the fourth, I think the fourth one we've redone here, de, uh, done by Javier, AKA Crows 4x4 out of California. Uh, this one had some surprises. We see some of the same stuff on all of them uh, now that we're pretty familiar with them. We've also shipped some kits to fix them. Uh, so uh, we got it in. Ripped out the whole front end, replaced it with our six inch leaf suspension. It's a 7.3 diesel, it's a 2000 model. Did a stage two front axle, 410 gears, standard brakes. It's got our FB003 front bumper, aluminum bumper. Sorry, it's dirty. I rinsed it off. We've had a bunch of bad weather and it's been hard keeping everything clean. Uh, rigid lights in the front bumper. It's got some 35 inch BFG. ATs on some American racing wheels super clean and simple single Fox 2.0 uh, we left the 1356 T case that it came with in there and re-geared the, the rear to 410 so when we pulled the rear apart I noticed it was a 355 which was odd well which isn't odd for the OE vans they you know it obviously came with that from the factory but I knew that the front ends never came with that so pulled that apart and the front diff was dry, I mean bone dry, not a drop of gear oil in it, and it had 373s. So it's a very good thing the customer didn't put it in four wheel drive. He probably would have grenaded the T case or broke something in the front end. So we fixed that problem. Um, other little things we found, no diff on the, uh, no breather on the T case, little things like that. Um, paint looks good from, from this distance. Um, what else do we find? The radius arm brackets, just like the ones we've seen in the past, they're they're just welded on with a few inches of weld. The bolts really aren't doing anything because they torch the holes out with a with a um, with a torch, so they're not not to fit. They just look like they're working. Um, the upper track bar mount, they've made efforts to beef those up by adding a lot more material. You can see some of the remnants. Um, they plated the the frame up there, so they've been making an effort to do that. I still think it'll it'll fail, but this one did not. So that's good. Um, any questions, give me a shout. Uh, I, just want, I want to emphasize I'm not trashing someone else's build. I've been accused of that in the past and that's not what we're doing here. Um, I get emails about vans like this on a weekly basis and guys are looking for help to fix them because maybe they didn't do the research ahead of time or they just don't know any better. But they get stuck with these vans that look like they're nice for a good price and then they start uncovering all the problems. So. When I stop getting those emails, I will stop, will stop fixing them, obviously, and I won't have to try to warn anyone. So, youjoinoffroad.com. Got any questions, leave them in the comments or email me, chris at youjoinoffroad.com. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook. We appreciate the support. Thanks very much.